Hi everyone, Mr. Christensen here. I want to make a quick tutorial video showing you how to go into class choice and change the, the, the class periods to where you want them. Um, just a little background about why you have to do this again, because I know you probably did this last spring, but over the summer we had some budget cuts, we had to move some teachers around, and we just found it was going to be easier just to go back and, and restart. So now you have to do uh, class choice again and, and choose your schedule again and get the class periods to when you want them. And so that's what this video is going to be helping you with. So the first thing that I would do is that maybe the easiest place to start is the, the district web page. So if you go to millardk12.org, again that's millardk12.org, um, you're going to go to the district web page which looks like this. Now, if you hover over where it says student, uh, students and family, it brings up a drop-down box. You're going to click on check grades. So check grades right there. And this brings you to the PowerSchool login page. So you should have your PowerSchool username and password. I've got a student that I know here at the school. So I'm going to put that information in now. And so once you got your username and password, hit uh, sign in, and it takes you to the PowerSchool page that looks like this. This is a very important page. Um, so up at the top, to get to Class Choice, um, I know it has a Class Choice uh, button over here, but that doesn't work. So to get to Class Choice, you're going to click on this box with an arrow coming out of it at the top right here. So I'm going to click on this box. And this brings up another option for Class Choice Student, and you're going to click on that link. And this page right here is Class Choice. So I'm going to take a second to explain everything on this page and how you're going to go through and change and, and pick the classes for, for each class period. So there is some instructions you can read. Um, I'm going to start down here with Student Schedule, and there's an A Day and there's a B Day Schedule. So this box on top is A day. Let's just start there. You have four class periods on A day and B day. So you'll see A1, uh, second period, third period, and fourth period. So what you do to pick a class for, for first period on A day is over here in this, in this box, it says edit. So underneath the number one, I'm going to hit this edit button. And this is where you can um, pick the classes that you would like. Now it's set up in semester, which means half a year, and so you're going to have to pick the class for the first half of the year and the second half of the year. And I know that most classes run a full the whole year, but you still got to pick that class for both semester one and two. And so here's how you'll do that. You're going to hit this drop down um, arrow right here, and it brings up this drop down box, and you can pick all the classes that are available for um, for this class period. And, and you'll notice it says open if it's available. You'll click on it. Okay, and so that's how you're going to pick your class for 1A. And, and the second semester. And then you're going to hit save changes. And that puts it into first period on A day. Now, notice here, let's go to second period on A day. World Civ is a full year class, but you still got to go in and put it in for first semester and second semester. Um, seminary release time, same thing. It's, it's a full year. You can take it a full year. You've got to do it for semester one and semester two. Um, if you go down, um, that's all for A day. Now let's go down to B day. Uh, language arts is a full year class. So let me just show you again how to do that. First period, I'm going to go to edit. And you hit this uh, first semester one, you're going to hit this drop down arrow and pick the class that you want to have on 1B. Um, and, and language arts is a full year class, so I'm going to pick the same class for semester two. And once you have that, that class in there, very important to hit save changes and, um, and, and you'll have it. Okay, and this is where you can make your schedule. Um, so you can take the classes, whatever class period they're available, and you kind of make up your own schedule. And if you've hit Save Changes, it should, be, it should be ready to go, and your schedule should be set. Anyway, I hope this helped, um, and, uh, and I hope that everything works for you.
good luck.